earlier this month, aged just 49. Today, fans came from far and wide to say goodbye, as Ham Pettigrew reports. The prodigy had asked its fans to raise the roof for Chief Keith. Hundreds did just that, bringing the streets of Braintree to a standstill. I just have to kind of pay my respects. I've known him a long time, so... I have to pay my respects. I have to support other warriors. That's what it'd be with everyone else. The warriors and... Yeah, just to celebrate his life, basically. Keith Flint, who was 49, was found in his home in the hamlet of North End near Dunmo in Essex on the 4th of March. The cause of his death, an inquest heard, was hanging. Keith grew up in Essex, moving to Braintree when he left school. It was here where he met fellow bandmate Liam Howlett and became a frontman of the prodigy. The band had its roots in the underground rave scene, but the group from Braintree went on to sell an estimated 25 million records worldwide. It was just a really important part of culture. It hasn't got a lot of culture, so this is a very important bit of it. When we grew up in the 1980s, 1988, 1989, the Captain on Sea, they used to play at Oscars back in the day. And we used to queue up all the way into the sound centre, and it was just off the grid. Crowds formed outside St. Mary's Church in Bucking. Shine on, Keith. I love you. The cortege arrived, greeted by cheers and applause. The Prodigy's Ant logo flying from the flagpole. The ceremony was for family and close friends only, including Keith's wife, Mayumi Kai, band member Liam Howlett. Speakers were set up outside the church to relay the service to fans. Many spoke of how Keith and the band's defiance of convention helped them accept their own differences. Whenever I felt a little bit down, I put on Christ out, I'd be like, right, let's get on with the day. If it wasn't for Prodigy, I will be probably a different person. They gave me permission. They just gave all of us, I think, a chance to be defiant, be a bit rebellious. Keith's bandmates described him as their brother and best friend, saying he was a true pioneer, innovator and legend. Someone whose influence on music fans say will endure. You can see by the turnout how much of an effect he's had on everybody. And Keith Flint forever shines on. Crazy Diamond. Mwah. Hannah Pettifer, ITV News, Braintree. And as I said, we love you, Keith. Crazy Diamonds, shine on forever.